everyone. This is my regular voice, mukbang, no ASMR, full face. <laughs> um, some of you guys have seen me because you guys follow me on Instagram and I have a couple of pictures of like my face and stuff. And then I also like always link down below my vlogging channel because I do vlog. But I am doing a Q&A with you guys about like a month ago, it's a long time ago, I asked you guys to ask me questions because I was going to do a q and A. I I got, oh I'm getting really white, <laughs> I got some Panera bread. Does it say Panera bread on here? Yes it does. <laughs> it's just my son's leftover, um, I got some grilled cheese. By the way, um, he, when I make these videos for you guys, he takes a nap, so I kind of have like just a little bit to you know get everything ready and do my video all before he even wakes up you know there's my bread bowl in fact it's called something, something. a baguette a baguette baguette my salad mm, i got the um the thai chicken salad i got the half and half i don't even know they have that i got the broccoli cheddar cheese because i love broccoli so this is my soup my salad my probably won't be eating this just extra I kind of want to eat this first because oh my gosh I've been wanting it so bad they didn't give me no fork okay oh my gosh I'm like out of breath from running <laughs> all right ah. okay so FYI I'm a little weird when I'm like talking or you know trying to keep you guys entertained so that's why I, I just stick to ASMR <laughs> so this is what it looks like really yummy it's gonna kind of oh my gosh I'm like out of breath you guys okay so I'm just gonna add all this I need to hurry up to do my uh, questions you guys are probably like okay is she ever gonna start her questions uh. mm. Mm -hmm. That's so good. First question. It ever pops up. Comes from Perla. It says, where do you record your videos? I used to record in my living room, which is right outside of here. That's my second living room, which like no one really goes to other than my kids to watch TV. But recently I was like, you know what? I feel like in a smaller room, it makes less background noise. So I started like recording in here and you guys like this. This is my um, like storage slash um, if you ever come and spend the night, this is where you sleep. <laughs> Next question is from Natalie Huenchunao. Is that, am I saying it right? She is asking where am I from? I am from Florida. Um, my family and I are from Mexico. But I was born here in Pennsylvania. Next person ask from Vinita Tuari. Tuari. She asks, "Where do I live? What do you do for a living? And finally, do you have any connections with India by any chance?" Um, I don't have any connections to India for a living. I just stay home and take care of my three kids. And also, it says, "Where do I live? I live in Florida." Mm. Mm. Celeste Conning asked, "What made you decide? What made you decide to start doing ASMR videos?" Well, I was, you know how like on YouTube you can go to your um like you can go to other videos that pop up you know that you aren't subscribed to so you can see new videos of new people well um sassy snacks popped up i don't know why like she just popped up like that's the only asmr kind of video that ever popped up on there and i was like you know i'm gonna see what she you know she was on there you know with her picture was of her eating and i, I don't even remember what it was anymore because it's been such a while well anyways um I ended up looking at her videos and I was like, oh my gosh, like, I really like this, you know? It's, um, it's different. Um. 
so yeah um i seen her and then after a little while i was like you know what i'm gonna try it if i can do it i can do it if not then i'll just you know at least i tried it you know i like to listen to these kind of videos so it's nice for me to make these my son oh my gosh he loves asmr he loves asmr ever since he heard me listening to it he like fell in love with it mm. Mm. Does that angle better? I'm sorry, it's it's trash day. It's trash day, you guys. So you're gonna be hearing a lot of that. Okay. Um, next person, Sass ASMR. You guys, she's so freaking good with her ASMR videos. Like, she's like one of my favorites to watch. She asked. Other than sushi, what kind of food can you eat every day? Well, I just posted um, the chile rellenos video. That is like my second favorite dish from sushi. Like, I love chile rellenos. Like, literally, I could eat them every day. And I know some people were commenting like, hey, you know, add sour cream or the red um, so like sauce that goes on top. But I do like it like that. But I just prefer it like... Um, simple i don't know why i just i love it like that it's so good mm. what is your least favorite food i don't really have a least favorite food i have some things that i don't like i don't like black olives i hate them i don't like mushrooms i don't like um green or the peas the green peas and that's it and third question of her is where would be where would your perfect picture vacation be with the family I wanted to go to um, Bora Bora I've seen it like pictures it looks so nice there next person is spritz time and she asked what do your family or immediate family think about you making asmr videos and do they watch as well mm. when i first started i didn't tell no one i didn't even tell my husband because i was kind of shy and then um like a little bit after I started, you know, I started getting subscribers and I was like so excited about that, you know, that people were watching my videos. So I told my, my mom, my sister, my brother, and my husband, of course, he was like the first one to know. And they were all like, you know, cool about it. They support me in it. I don't think they watch my videos. My husband does. He'll tell me that he watches my videos. But they're all supportive, which is, you know, really good. Natalia Radio asks, Do you watch other ASMR mukbang channels? Yes, I do. I watch a lot. A lot of people. Melania Ramad Ramadanti. She says, what is your favorite food? Sushi. <laughs> Ashley Garcia, what inspired you to do ASMR videos? By the way, I love your videos. Thank you so much, Ashley. Um, sassy snacks. Inspire me. <laughs> I don't know why I'm eating and talking. She made me, um, you know, want to try it out for myself. Even though she's like queen of ASMR, like no lie. Oh my goodness. That's soda, by the way. <laughs> uh, Divine Foods. What camera and mic do you use? Um, I use my iPhone 5S and my mic. I can't remember. I can't remember the name of it, but it was like a 
an $18 one, I think, from Amazon. Mm. Oh my goodness, this is so good. Mm. I'll keep looking at myself like... <laughs> this is a lot of salad. Yeah, I'm like really weird, you guys. Mm. Yolanda Rodriguez, she asked, do you like cooking? I do like cooking. But when I cook, mm, I kind of pick up my food every time I'm cooking. So by the time I'm done, I don't even eat with, like, I kind of just sit there with, like, a little plate, you know, because I'm kind of full already. Who else does that? Like, I can't, like, cook a full meal and not taste nothing. I'm just, like, picking at it, like, mm, you know? Um... Our window sign as besides sushi, oriental food being your favorite, what else do you enjoy eating? And do your children enjoy the same thing, the same food? Mm. I like, I like, I love eating any kind of food. Like, it doesn't matter where it's at. If it's good, which. And I'm open to like trying new things like um, the spring roll that I made. That was the first time that I ever, you know, made it and ate it. And you guys watched me and I enjoyed it. You know, um, I'm open to eat new foods, but I love any kind of food. Like I am a food girl. Like I love food, you know. And yeah, my kids enjoy too. They enjoy like the same foods that I do. Like anything that we go out to eat you know different place they enjoy it like they'll try it you know if they don't like it they'll let me know but they're open to try it as well which is good <laughs> danny boy 2649 hey question number one is is there any type of food that you haven't tried yet but you want to uh I want to try, I haven't tried Indian food, and you know what, like right down the street, there's a um, family that, they have like an Indian um, food truck, and they pass by my house every day, you know, I guess when they're done for the day with their food truck, and I'm like, man, one day I'm going to go ask them like, hey, you got to whip up some food for me. <laughs> mm. Question number two from him is, what is a goal that you have set for yourself that you have reached or are still reaching for it? Mm. My goal was to see, you know, how out there my videos can get, you know, how much communication that I can get with you guys. And I feel like I reached it. I don't have that many subscribers, but I don't really care about that. Like, I care more about who like views my videos who gets relaxed by it like the communication the comments like are amazing like that was my goal you know that was my goal to like make someone relax have someone comment and say you know you made me relax thank you so much i love your videos that was it for me i love that i love i love hearing that you guys are relaxed by my videos i'll try really hard <laughs> You know to make the videos perfect for you guys <sighs> mm. 
Okay. I just noticed that I didn't take a picture with my food. <laughs> Um, okay. Katie Bradley asked a couple of questions. She said, what branch was your hubby in and where were you all stationed? Where was your favorite? My husband was stationed, or my husband was, um, oh gosh. My husband was in the Marine Corps. He um, he was stationed in Japan. But when he was stationed over there, um, we were just, you know, boyfriend and girlfriend. So I never, like, you know, went over there. And um, this looks so good. Mm. Oh, my goodness. Wow, my gosh, I'm sorry. Okay, so he was stationed in Japan and then we got married. He came back to the United States. He was stationed in North Carolina. And I was gonna go with him, but right when I got married, like maybe a week or two later, he was sent off to Iraq and he was over there while he was over there, I was pregnant. I didn't find out that I was pregnant until, you know, after he left. So, yeah, I, I had to tell him that over the phone. <laughs> um, yeah, so I didn't really get to travel. You know, once he came back, you know, I told him to just get out because I didn't want him to leave anymore. You know, because we had our first baby together. Mm. Well, yeah. I never got to like really travel with him. Number two ask how old am I? I'm 25. <laughs> how long did your did your husband serve? He served four years. It says, what do you do besides being a mom? And what does your husband do? Vice versa. I am just at home. I did have a boutique business online. Um, I sold bowls, tutus, um, Stuff like that, like, you know, necklaces for little girls. Um, but after I had my third baby, uh, my son, he kind of, like, did not let me do anything. So, you know, it takes a little while to have to make, you know, bows and stuff. You know, um, like, boutique bows. Like, I, I guess I'll show you guys a little bit right here. And he wouldn't really let me, so I would get orders. And I kind of felt bad because I would be canceling or, you know, delaying. And I don't like that. So, I kind of just stopped. Um, my husband, he's a semi driver. What is your dream job? Oh my gosh. If I could, my dream job would be getting paid to eat. <laughs> nah, um, I think my dream job would be like, I've always wanted to be a vet. I love animals, but I don't know if I would be able to, like, I don't know, I guess, like, do surgery on them or something, you know? I just kind of like being around animals a lot. <laughs> um, and then your last question is, do you plan on having more children? I have three. Mm. Oh, man, it's so good. I am not sure if I would have any more. We did talk, me and my husband did talk about having another one, but this last one... He is crazy, crazy, and such a mama's boy that I'm always saying, oh my God, imagine, imagine if we were to have another baby, like, he would go crazy. <laughs> mm. This is so good, you guys. Mm. Delicious. Mm. Oh, 
Okay, my phone is like, it's frozen, you guys. It's frozen. That's why I upgraded. <laughs> Tammy Ober. Ask how old am I? I'm 25. I'm going to be 26 this year in October. Um, oh, look. Someone had responded. <laughs> they said, I'm assuming the 91 in her username is the year she was born, so that would make her 26 this year if she isn't already. You're right. Mm. Mihir Jinawa Jinaw Jinwala ask how many dollars spent on food on food videos a month? Mm. It depends. Um, you know I try not to spend too much. Mm. But, like, before I even started my channel, I really would spend a lot of money on, you know, on um, food and stuff. Like, you can ask my husband. Before I started this, before I started all of this, every week I would go out and get so much food. Like, I'm a, I'm a food lover. Like, I'm always thinking about food. Three in the morning, thinking about food. Mmm. Mmm. Tasbi Mahoud ask if you could choose to eat one thing for the rest of your life what would you choose oh my gosh it's like really hard between chiles rellenos and sushi but I think I would go with sushi mm. just because I can mix it up you know have different things Okay. Mm. I hope I'm not boring you guys. Like, it's already at 30 minutes. <laughs> Bit Ange. Hey, girl. Her question is, what have you always wanted in life and did you get it? I did get it. I want in life an awesome husband, a great marriage, you know, um, and kids. I love kids. I got married when I was like 17 and we already, me and him would talk about like, oh my gosh, like imagine when we do plan on having kids, like, you know, cause we weren't planning on having kids when we got married, but it just kind of happened that way. So yeah, like, you know, just a great family, like, that's just what I've always wanted in life, you know? Obviously, there's more stuff, like, getting a great job, you know, being stable in life, but to me, like, most importantly is family, communication, marriage. We're going to have nine years married this year. Oh my gosh, I got scared for a little bit. Um, I have a, a sister and a brother, and they're both older than me. I'm the baby of the family. Mm. Oh, man. Um, me and my husband, well... Kind of knew each other our whole life. Kind of, you know. Um, my mom knows his family. My, my family knows my husband's family really good. For years. So far back that my mom took care of my husband and his older sisters and brothers when they were little. My mom changed my husband's diapers. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> but 
And then my sister was really good friends with my husband. They graduated the same year. They were like, you know, a group of friends. And, um, I didn't really see him because obviously I wouldn't hang out with my sister so much. She's five years older than me, so she do, she would do different things than me. And one time, my sister went to go pick me up at my friend's house. And my husband, not at the time, he was my husband at the time. I was only like 12. They went to go pick me up. She was with him and another friend. And her friend, she was sitting up front with my sister. And my husband, Julian, was sitting in the back. So I had to sit in the back and I just sat down and I looked at him. I'm like, gross, you know, like, ew, like, why do I have to sit by this guy, you know? <laughs> and I never talked to him the whole ride. I, I just looked outside. I'm like, man, can't wait to get home. My sister dropped me off and she left with her friends. And that was the last time I seen him for like a couple of years. <laughs> Mm. I'm almost done. Like this outside part is like really hard. I have to like dig in with my nails. Mm. Look, I got my nails done. It was like long overdue to get them done. I have a couple of videos that I made and I'm kind of like behind on them because it's hard for me to like sit down and edit you know while all the kids are here I feel like sometimes I miss some parts because I have a lot of semis that come by here very loud I don't know if you guys heard them right now but I mean I've been talking pretty loud so mm. this is so good <laughs> <laughs> I need to check if <clears throat> the rest of the questions. Uh, Louis Villasenor ask, Are you Hispanic? Yes, I am. I am. Soy Mexicana. My family is from Chihuahua. Um, I have three dogs. Crazy dogs. They bark at everything <laughs> and anything, literally. Did you guys hear that semi? I feel like every time I hear semi, I'm just like, ugh. I remember that someone asked why can't I make videos every single day and I wish I could I really do but like um I can't really make videos every day because I have my son my, my one and a half year old son and sometimes he takes a nap sometimes he doesn't and like I have like as soon as he takes a nap I have like to hurry up you know to do the you know dish or either I have to go with him to go out to get food come back put him to sleep do my you know video and that's it like right as soon as I'm done no lie he wakes up <laughs> uh I have a vlogging channel not to promote or anything but yeah like you know if you want to see more about me like I post a lot you know family stuff there um and I do have a link to it down below like um I think in October was it in October yeah I think in October I did the um vlogtober like I vlogged every single day and I wanted to keep doing that but like you know I use my phone to vlog and I recently did buy me a um, vlogging camera which is so cool but now I need, you know, to upgrade my computer and it's kind of hard, like, I don't know. I'm like really enjoying this. Um, my name, I, ha I did see so that someone asked me, what does my username, eatwithjazz91 mean? 
And basically it just means like eat with me, Jasmine. My whole name is Jasmine and it's like eat with me, you know, eat with jazz. And I didn't put no ASMR or anything because I wanted this to be ASMR and also like regular voice mukbang. I don't know, you know, if you guys enjoy those. And I didn't, I didn't know like, you know, should I mix them two together because I've only kind of been making ASMR. I like fell in love with doing that kind. I just took out some of my hair. I don't know if you guys seen that. Um, but yeah, like I was thinking, you know, I'll, I'll do some ASMR and I'll do some regular face mukbang on this channel. And then, so that's why I didn't put ASMR. Like if you guys enjoy this ASMR, even though, or if you guys enjoy this regular voice mukbang, let me know. And I'll definitely be doing more of these if you guys like them only. And, um, yeah, like, this one's, like, extra long, though. I don't think I would be making these videos, like, super long, you know? I think this is just because I was doing the Q&A, obviously. But, yeah, like, I, I talk a lot. Like, I can talk forever. Like, I think sometimes when my husband gets home, I'm, like, talking so much that I feel like I talk his head off. Like, I end up getting bored of my own voice. Like, you know? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, <laughs> yeah, um, I don't even know what I'm going to say. Oh yeah, and then 91 and stands for my birthday year. Uh, my birthday date <laughs> is October 1791. Um, yeah, I'm going to be 26, you guys. Uh, I had my first child at 17. Well, a month before I turned 18. I got married at 17 uh and then i had my next child at like 19. yeah 19. they're like 18 months apart and there were two girls and then my son i just had him like two years ago i'm kind of done with my food it was super good uh I'm, i think i'm gonna eat this like later on maybe i hope you guys enjoyed this q a regular voice mukbang for full face <laughs> um if you guys did enjoy it let me know Give me a like, like that button, leave me some comments down below, any questions that you guys want to ask, you know, that I didn't answer here, um, I'll be happy. To answer them there, well, I'll see you guys in the next video, ASMR.